very tasty and fragrant puffs with juicy strawberry filling. Such puffs will not stay in your kitchen for more than 30 minutes after baking. 1. Prepare the products. Defrost the dough at room temperature. Wash the berries. Cut off the tails. Whether to use starch or not is up to you. But the juice will be released in any case, just not in such an amount. If you use starch, then roll each berry well in it, before putting it on the dough. Now I will show you several ways to make simple and beautiful puffs. Let's get started. 2. Method 1. Spread the dough on the table. Roll it out a little. You don't need to make it thin. With the help of cuttings for cookies, make circles. Leave half of the circles intact. And in others make holes in the center. With the help of cutting a flower. 3. Put the berries on the dough. 4. Cover the dough with holes, as in the photo. Press down the edge with a fork, or the back of a knife. Done. 5. The second way. Cut the dough into squares. Using a pizza knife, cut the dough as in the photo. Two corners, cut to the end, and the opposite two, do not cut to the end. 6. Lay one cut corner on the opposite side, then flip the second corner of the dough, and apply it exactly to the other edge. 7. Fill the baskets with strawberries. Done. 8. The third way. Cut the dough into rectangles. Cut half of the rectangle with a pizza knife, as in the photo. 9. Put the berries on the other side. 10. Cover with the cut half. Press the edge. Decorate it with a fork. 11. Transfer the puffs to the parchment. Brush with the oak. Sprinkle generously with sugar. Place in a hot, 220 degree, oven for 20 minutes. 12. Bon Appetit. I got two identical baking sheets of puffs, from 500 grams of dough. Here are such beautiful puffs.